everybody, my name is Cristal Omaga. I'm here at Fitness Armory, our gym here in Timog, Quezon City. I'm an NAFC certified personal trainer. I'm also from Canada, but I'm also a mestiza Filipino. <laughs> I know you don't really see that. <laughs> I'm a national soccer athlete in Canada, and I'm also a national basketball athlete in Canada. I love to skydive, jump off cliffs, and paraglide. Anyways, guys, Come follow me and be with me for our flat stomach workouts. All right, exercise number one. First, we have the leg raises. So, how do we do a leg raise? Well, we're gonna be working our abs for this, obviously. So we're gonna come with our legs up, both feet up to the air, and we're gonna have our feet nice and flexed. We're gonna have our legs 90 degrees straight. All right, so now we're gonna count for five seconds to put our feet to 45 degree angle. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. All right, hold for two seconds at the 45 degree angle. One, two, and slowly come back up for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. So you guys are gonna do three sets, meaning eight times three. Oh, that's a lot. 8, 16, 24 times you're gonna do that. Ah, but you guys will be awesome at doing it. So you're gonna rest break for only 30 seconds. So now for the advanced version of the leg raise. Here we go, we're gonna go down to just about an inch off the floor. One, two, three, four, five. Hold for two seconds. One, two, come back up. Five seconds. One, two, three, four, Five. All right, we're on to the second workout, and man, do I already feel the burn with the leg raises, but we still got two more to go. So let's get on to the second workout. We're gonna do side oblique twist. All right, so beginner version. We're gonna come to their side in a side plank position. Everything's aligned, nice and straight, just like a tree or a door. We're gonna bring our knees a little bit bent, and we're gonna prop ourselves up onto our forearm. So. Make sure your elbow and your shoulder are aligned, nice and straight so you don't hurt the shoulder. Hand can be flat on the floor. You're gonna bring your hip off the ground and support with your knee. So, when you come up, you're gonna be in a nice straight long line and supporting with your knee and your feet nice and flat. So, you should feel the pressure here in your forearm and on your knees and feet. All right, we're gonna have our hands up to the sky you can have it in a fist position or in a straight high five position. We're gonna take our right arm, we're gonna put it across our body, through our body, punch the back wall, and we're gonna slowly come back up. Again, we're gonna do this for eight to 10 times, three sets, guys. 30 second rest between each set. All right, so if you guys are intermediate or advanced, Let's get it to be a little bit harder. So we're gonna come again into a side plank position, straightening our knees. So the only support that we're gonna have is on our forearm and this time our feet. All right, we're gonna come up, make sure everything's aligned. Your head, your shoulders, your hips, and your feet are one straight line like a long, tall tree. Okay, gonna have our hands up in a fist or high five position. I'm gonna do a fist. And we're gonna put our arm through our body and punch the back wall. We're gonna slowly come back up to start position. All right, guys, again, we're gonna do that for eight to 10 reps, three sets, and we're gonna have 30 second rest between each one. Good luck, guys, I already feel the burn. Woo, time for a flat stomach. All right, on to the third exercise. Workout number three. We are gonna do the pike. This one is gonna burn not only your abs, but your whole body. So let's get to it. You're gonna need equipment for this. If you guys have a bonsu ball like this, you can use it on a more carpet surface or turf surface like here, like we're using today. Or you can use a towel on a wooden floor, let's say. So I'll be using in excess, instead of a towel, I'll be using sliders, just because we have a turf only right now. So that is okay. But let's get on to the pike workout. Here we go. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take the bounce ball, bring it onto our shins, come up into a front plank position. All right, from here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna drag or roll the ball 
towards our head and our butt is going to go towards the sky. It will look like this. Again, drag the ball towards your head, butt to the sky. Then you're going to roll back to start position. Again, up, down, up, down, up, down. One more, up, down. Whew. All right, so again, we're going to do this eight to 10 reps for three sets with a 30 second rest between exercises. All right guys, so if you have a wooden floor or not a carpet, anything that's slippery, you can use a towel if you don't have a bond spot or I have here sliders. So the towels and sliders are basically the same. They're both gonna slide on the floor. All right, so how we're gonna do this is we're gonna put the towel or the slider underneath your feet, place them underneath our feet Toes are going to be on it, and we're going to have our wrists, elbows, shoulders aligned. We're in a all fours position. Make sure that the hands and the knees are all in one line, all aligned. Towel or slider will be under your feet. You're going to pop up into a front plank position. Gaze is going to be down, core is going to be engaged. You're going to slowly drag your feet towards your head and your butt's gonna go up to the sky. So, like this. And slowly come back down. So again, you want the toes towards your head and you want your butt towards the sky. Let's do two more. Up towards the sky, feet towards your head, and then all the way back to the side. Last one. Whew. All right, guys, so that was the third and final exercise. Hope you guys feel the burn. I'm already out of breath just doing a few of them. All right, again, it is eight to 10 reps for three sets with 30 seconds in between. I hope you guys enjoyed this workout. Let's get to it. I hope you guys had an awesome workout. Thank you so much for watching the Be Kami workout program and working out with me. Again, if you guys have YouTube, come follow me, Miss Cristal. Come follow Be Kami. Follow, like, and subscribe. If you guys have Instagram, come follow me because it's my jam at Miss Cristal. Also, for daily workout tips, please, please, please watch out for the new coming program I'm creating called Model Fit PH. Thank you guys for watching again. I hope you guys had fun.